In question 14, we're shown a picture of a three-dimensional real-life case, if you like. You've got your broomstick leaning up against the corner of a wall. Now, the best way of tackling these is to redraw any right angle triangle you can spot here as a flat plane figure. So I marked him a 0.5 metres there, 0.3 metres there, shaded in the base. And even though it may not look like it, that's a right angle. I then need to find this base length, that's the distance out from the corner of the two walls that the uh, broomstick lies. Once I'm armed with that, I then work in this second right angle triangle with a 1.5 metre hypotenuse in order to find out how far up the wall it goes. Breaking a question into two parts is a long way to finding success in this subject. Having done that, I can write that figure we found the 0.8583 metres on the second triangle. A broomstick, the base, I'm now after the height that it reaches up the wall. Now clearly this is the hypotenuse, so when I write down my formula, it becomes 1.5 squared. You could choose to do the transposition at this stage. Or y squared if you like. And the square root So the broomstick reaches 1.38 metres up the wall.